Okay, so before we even get into this film session, Chuck's so core four does get beat by a six round pick, but that shouldn't even be surprising at this point. And the only way to get this all 22 footage is to screen record the broadcast if you want to do that next game. But let's get into this film session. What I want us to watch right here is Kevin Dotson's feet, right? They never ever stop moving. And this is impressive because he's so strong and a lot of the times, with O linemen who are very strong, have naturally very powerful strength. They don't have the fastest feet, but that's not the case with Kevin Dotson. And he's very technical, so you gotta love every part of Kevin Dotson's game. And watch him just move this D tackle up to the second level. Literally not pulling over or taking out a linebacker, moving a D tackle to the second level. He knows how to use his leverage. He has the power to go along with that. And his footwork is amazing. Or as Charles Barkley would say, feet work. So Kevin Dotson is really the savior of this O-line. And if he goes down or isn't starting, yeah, you can throw the whole season away because he is our rock on that front line. And him and Pat Fryermuth do a good job of coming the other way and making this room for Jalen Samuels. Now, of course, this isn't as impressive as last clip, but he's still executing on a high level. And hopefully, hopefully Mike Tomlin starts him in next week's game. Now again, his pass protection, it, it does not need any explanation. And you know, I know a lot of people are gonna be saying, oh, well, these are against backup DNs. Yeah, but he did it to your DNs as well. He did it to DeForest Buckner. He did it to the Browns DNs. He did it to the Ravens DNs. He did it to every other DN that he played. So him and Clem are a perfect combination as we see another physical block by him, a perfect combination for fixing our O line. And I just heard this thing from a commentator, you know, if you get enough dogs in the locker room, eventually the cats are gonna bark. So hopefully people follow along with Kevin Dotson and Dan Moore is looking really good as well as we see another solid block right there. So I'll have a Dan Moore film session out soon as well. But for now, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and that's it from me on this one. Peace. Let me know your thoughts on Kevin Dotson and our O-line.